Hey guys, Tricky Boy here once again. Welcome back to Football Manager 2015. We're in the Parma save as we are trying to get ourselves out of Serie D. As you can see, it's going rather well so far. You know, we've had the two updates that I've done before um, and the live games that you've seen before. Obviously, we're expected to win this league comfortably. And it is proving to be that way at the moment. We're 12 points clear at the minute with 10 games left to go. So, another... What, four victories? No, I can't even do basic maths. If we win half of our games, we've won the league. It's as simple as that. So we're gonna go in, we're gonna go check where we are in the table. As you can see, we can check it from here. But I'm gonna get a better overview so we get a bit more sort of, you know, you get a bit more of an idea as to how well we're actually doing. So we've played 28 games, won 26, drawn two, lost zero, which is great. The two draws have been annoying. We've been over those a few times. <clears throat> Excuse me. Goals for 111, goals against 17, a goal difference of 94. That's kind of where we're going with this season so far. It's proving to be a great season, as expected. Now, as my phone decides to make noises once again, every time I try and record, people try and get involved. Never mind. Anyway, we're going to go into our squad here. As you can see, this squad is massively different, as in size, compared to last time. We've got rid of a hell of a lot of players, and I, when I'm saying a hell of a lot of players, I genuinely mean it. Uh, but we're going to go look at the stats for some players. Obviously, Bonazzoli is the first place to go. The guy's got 32 goals in 26 games. Absolute nightmare for anybody in this division. I really hope I can keep him. I really, really do. But my front three, really, are... We're looking at Insigne, Pozzi, and Bonazzoli, and they've all got sort of 20, 17, 20, and 32. That, I can't really ask for more out of those guys. Bonazzoli's been injured, thankfully has come back, and just got carried on scoring goals. Now, when I say we've lost a lot of players, I genuinely do mean it. Let's go take a look. Uh, let me if we go into our under-20s. Wow, so noisy when I'm trying to record. Awesome. So, <laughs> transfers, transfer history. Um, do you know what? If I do this, does it tell me how many people are there? 151. 151 people have left this club since the start of the season. That includes free agents, that includes players that have left and moved up a division or, you know, moved to other teams. We've got this guy here who uh, got offered a contract from Olympiacos. Obviously, I don't get a say in that. You know, if he wants to leave, he, ha he can leave. That's fine. It's just, it's gone crazy. I mean, a lot of these guys have been complaining they weren't playing football, so they've gone anyway. Um, <clears throat> but we are getting to a point now where we have our squad for the rest of the season. Ten games left to go. And we're starting to look at building for next season. So in the next update, you're going to see me looking at players. You're going to see me making bids for players and looking where we need to improve. Um, and also probably getting some of these players... Yeah, again, some of these players aren't really good enough for me. Um, some of them will have to leave. But we'll see. I mean, it's going to be interesting. Let's take a quick look at something that I need to show you, and that's the results. Um, we've got a couple of draws in here, as you can see. We got the one old draw, which we mentioned in the last video. We've had a two old draw since we last did the update, but this is the one that annoyed me. The Serie D Cup, fifth round, we lost 2-0 away from home. And it put us out of the cup. Now, I really wanted to win that trophy. Just for something. You know, just so we'd won something. Unfortunately, it didn't happen. Um, we, we lost away from home 2-0. It was a surprise. It was a big surprise. But, hey. You know, I guess we have to look on the positives. I'm trying to get through this season as quick as possible. Um, we're going to win this league. We're going to get promoted. We've got our squad size down to a manageable number. I mean, I don't know how many players I have in total. Um, but it's not... It's not like it was. Like I say, I've got rid of 151 players have left. It's just an insane amount of people to be going. But that's it, guys, for this little update. Um, I will do another one if and when we decide we're going to win the league. Um, depending on how results go, I may do a live con just for the last game. Um, the game that we, if I know we're going to win the league or something like that, I'll do a live con so we get to see the joy and all that sort of stuff and live through all that. But yeah, we'll just see how it goes. As always, guys, if you have liked this, you know, if you want to leave a, a comment or a like me, you know, whatever you want to do, that would be great. Um, the support for this series has been really good, actually, so I'm really happy with how it's going. Um, and, yeah, 
Let's let's power through and get on to the next season, and uh, let's move ourselves up the divisions. Thanks for watching, guys, and uh, we'll see you next time.